Hebrews 8, verse 13 says, In that he saith a new covenant, he hath made the first old. Just by saying new, you've made that one old. In that he saith the new, he hath made the first old. Now listen to what he says. That which has been made old, I'm reading in there, now that which is made old decays and waxeth old and is ready to vanish away. And it ain't just talking about vanishing away in reality. It's talking about vanishing away from your conscience. So why does God come talking about a new creation? Why does God come talking about a new man? To make the first man, Adam, that was subject to death old. And to make the first creation that Adam subjected to vanity old. And old meaning, in our minds, we've forgotten about it. Our mind isn't filled with the old creation that's subject to death. But our mind is filled with the new creation that is under the reign of an indestructible life. Our mind is not filled with the old man that's subject to the death and the calamity and the destruction of this earth. But our mind has become filled with the new man that reigns through the power of an indestructible life. 